Hello YouTube. I got my shipment of round stock for the little A's. Okay. We got some 360 brass. They call it free machining. Quarter inch diameter. Got a piece half inch diameter. Kind of spendy. I didn't want to get too big. Okay. And then I got some half inch diameter 1018. Okay. Now, it might be hard to pick it up on the camera. I tried it. This is 12L14. This, to me, listing here has a higher ring to it. There's not a sticker on this one because these are random lengths. Anywhere from 10 to 12 inches. It's cheaper than buying a piece of foot long. So I went the cheaper route. I've already marked it with my Sharpie. I trust them. Uh, one inch of 12L14. Now, this was kind of spendy. Uh, might as well say the price here. Uh, the one inch. This is seven bucks for that. Okay, like this piece of aluminum. Well, like 527. This is a 62, bear with me. 6262, okay? This is supposed to be able to polish real good. It's not your regular aluminum. I've seen aluminum in there that was, I would say, is the common that can be anodized and stuff. This is supposed to be able to be polished better. And don't quote me, I think it machines a little better too. Whatever's in this aluminum uh, for an amateur like me. So that's where I got it from. I'll show it real quick. Okay, I'm always pause look at that. Uh, really happy. It took three days, but it's only two days to ship uh, because I called the order in Tuesday. They processed the order like Wednesday morning. So it was out the door in two days. Uh, just a few state, states away from me, uh, they're out of Ohio, so to hit the Midwest, they even have a little map in there that tells you, because they have warehouses all over the country, they have several different spots, so you can get it pretty quick, there's more than one location for this, so go check them out if you're into this stuff, I think I'm going to like this, this was kind of different, I have had aluminum in my hand before and looked at it, we will find out what it's like. I will take a small piece and play with it. Uh, maybe like an inch. I'll cut just a little bit off. It's a shame that that ain't on there. Whatever was stamped on there. But I do trust them. Like I said, this sounds like it has a higher ring to me. And then just that 1018. No matter what I do, this is duller. And I'm learning this, so that's why I got two types of this. 10, 18 miles still, 12, 0, 14 has lead in it. I learned that by watching different videos on YouTube. It's supposed to make it easier to machine, especially with a big hunk like this I'm making something out of. Who knows what I'll use this big, big piece for. I may want to make some kind of spacer or washer or something, so I'm not going to make no big object out of this. I want this to last. I might come up with some idea I need some little parts or something. So I'm not going to make nothing real big out of this. Uh, same with aluminum, I'll probably make a plumb bob and then polish it up. So we'll see how good that turns out. So future projects for this winter, I'll include a couple pictures. Nice container, that cap goes in there. I did bend these back when I got it. I bent these back to get it out of the cardboard. There's one on each end, they put a piece of tape over it. So you got a reusable container. Uh, ship something to your friend. You want to ship something to somebody when you're done? Uh, you got reusable cardboard. Recycle. But thanks for watching. I want to make this a real short video and get it out there before the weekend. So thank you again.